As we head through the day, we've got our southeast winds, which will help send our sea breeze inland. And that means any showers and storms we get today will mainly be back to the west and off to the south. But overall coverage, I don't expect very many locations to see rain today. Uh, like yesterday, there'll be a few little pockets. In fact, I think we'll even have fewer today than we had yesterday. Uh, by 3 o'clock, you can see that sea breeze line starts to develop and then a couple of showers start to form and push inland, uh, especially to the south, Polk, Osceola County, Southern Brevard, especially inland Brevard County. And then notice through the evening commute, not a lot of locations, just a few little pockets will be tracking through tonight. Temperatures, meanwhile, will be warm, much like yesterday. We will hit 93 in the villages, 93 in Eustis, and 93 in Claremont. 93 Oviedo, also Orlando and Winter Park, 93 in Kissimmee and St. Cloud. So our inland spots will be a few degrees warmer than average. And then the coast will stay slightly cooler because of the southeast breeze. We'll top out at 88 in Flagler Beach, 89 Merritt Island, and 89 in Palm Bay. Now tomorrow will be similar to today. Just a 30% coverage of storms, mainly late in the day. And back to the west with those southeast winds still coming in. Uh, but gradually into the weekend, we're going to start building the moisture back in. So we're going to start seeing a higher coverage of storms each afternoon. I don't expect a total washout on Sunday, but there will be more areas of rain. And in fact, once we get into early next week, there's an even higher chance. And that's because there's an area of low pressure that's expected to develop in the Gulf of Mexico and bring more moisture our way. Now, the question now is, will this low pressure develop into some kind of tropical system. It is a very low chance of that happening by about Tuesday. At this point, about a 20% chance of some development, but we'll keep you posted. Nothing has formed yet. In fact, you can see in the Gulf, things are very quiet uh, right now with just a couple of scattered clouds. So keep checking back, we'll keep you posted. Meanwhile, today and tomorrow, just a couple of storms, and then we'll start to see that moisture increase for Saturday and for Sunday.